Why, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Primal Carnage Extinction. Now, I know it's been awesome, is not it? And we are starting like a little mini series here where I'm going to do a dedicated video for each class and see what each class is like after 3.0, since there were so many changes and more are coming. Um, we're starting with Cryolophosaurus, as you can see, because recently it did get a nuclear buff, which I did cover in another video not too long ago, so definitely check that out. And it got nerfed down to 130 nuclear spit damage. What this series is going to entail is just basically going to be me playing one or two rounds without my beautiful voice for most of it, except for the intros and that, because I'll talk about what I think about the class and date that the class is in. So Cryolophosaurus, I think it's in a good position. Uh, in this session, we got two cryo rounds. I got one where the humans win and one where the dinos win. The round that's currently being played is the dino win one and the other one is the human win one, which I'll talk about later. Uh, this round was actually really interesting because, you know, we had a, had a good start and then the humans got really sweaty towards the end. I think there was like one death where a dude literally spawned behind me. You're lucky I didn't have my microphone on for that one. I can tell you I know. But anyway, back to the topic of the video. Crowlophosaurus. It is the hot talk of the community right now because of its buffs and it, it is absolutely insane. In this video, I think I get like one or two direct hits which do which do 130 damage. Yeah, a lot of people are not happy with it. I forgot to mention that the cryo spit Whenever you get a kill with a cryo spit, you get some stamina back as well, which I think is nuts. I think half the stamina regen would be reasonable, but for some reason, the devs want you to have infinite nuclear bombs. Fix it. Right, anyway, back to me rambling on about cryo. I think someone made a really good point on the Discord that it feels very oppressive to fight. How would I fix this clan? I think Cryolophosaurus, it's, it's damage needs a nerf. Now I have heard rumours that they're going to put like a uh, cooldown on the uh, spit bite. You have a cooldown before you can bite after you spit. Don't know if that's going to really help. I mean, my suggestion would be to probably nerf the spit damage down to like 100. I think 100 is the maximum it should be. But other than that, Cryolophosaurus is definitely in a really strong position. And yeah, I, I agree with the community. It does need a nerf. But right, I'm going to leave you for now and we'll wait till the next round begins. So enjoy the rest of this round. Oh, and if you do like this, please leave a like, comment, what changes would you like to see in this Cryolophosaurus? And which class should I do next?
Okie dokie, I have returned with my beautiful voice. Now humans were actually quite dominant this round, but I wanted to put this video in just to show how effective this class is, even under the strenuous adversities of humans winning. Because I think that is a gauge of how strong a class is if it's on the losing side. And it just shows how bonkers Kralophosaurus is right now. And I'm doing Kralophosaurus first because 100% Dinosaur is going to nerf it. And I, I am not recording these again. This is like my third time doing this. Because I've done it when it got his original buff and now I've done it after the nerf. And now, ugh. I gotta do it first because I didn't do it the ARs quick enough and Dinosauriac changed it every three days. And don't worry, I know Thanksgiving is coming soon. There will be a Thanksgiving video for you guys. Um, yeah, there's not much to say here. So I'm just gonna disappear and let you enjoy the rest of this gameplay. 